Hello everyone. I hope you had an awesome first day of distance learning. So I've received a couple of requests from parents on how we can churn in a Google Doc that your child's working on. So right now I am just logged in as Haley um, and I want to take you back to the main screen. So right now it says that I am logged in as Haley, but right here next to it, the Google Apps, all of this is automatically linked to your child's Clever Badge when they log in. So they have access to their Gmail, they have access um, to their Google Drive, here's Docs and Classroom. There are a couple of different ways that you can churn in a Google Doc through Google Classroom. So the very first thing I wanna do is click on the uh, Google Classroom for Mrs. Crocker's class. Now there's a couple of different um, ways that we can do this. So if I were to go to classwork um, and I wanted to click on this assignment, so what have you been up to? This is actually due tomorrow. So I wanna click view assignment. So there are a couple of different things. Um, the Google Docs is already right here for Haley to work on that the teacher created. But if your child was working within Google Docs already, or wants to work in Google Docs, there are two different options. The first one is add or create, and this will go straight to Google Docs. So I can go right here, and I'm creating it here, and then I can log in as soon as it's created. I can just click this. All right, maybe this one's taking a little bit longer. There we go, okay. So what have you been up to? I can go ahead and type right in here and then I can, once I start doing it, it will work and then I can just turn it in from here. Um, but if I wanted to show you another way, so for example, if your child went straight here and started working on a Google Doc and this I'm still under Haley's account and I wanted to create my own, I could just start completing my work here and um, then once I click here, I'll automatically take the text from here. So this is now in my Google Drive. So if I were working on, I'm gonna, an assignment, and here is my Google Drive. The, the first one that pops up is the Google Docs that I was just working on. And I can go ahead and click add right here. And it will, I don't have to necessarily use this if I've um, wor been working on an essay. So here it is. And if I click turn in here, it'll not only turn in this one, but it'll also turn in the Google Doc I was doing. I'm gonna go ahead and delete this for now since I don't wanna mess it up. But then all you would have to do is click turn in and that is how you can work within Google Drive with a spreadsheet, a Google Forms, or a Google Doc, any of the Google app extensions, and how I would attach it to an assignment within a classroom. It works um, very similar, and then just click turn in, and all of that would be done. All right, I hope this was helpful. Please reach out to me if you need any other video tutorials for anything at all, and um, I will talk to you all soon, and I miss you so much, and have an awesome day. Thanks, everyone. Bye-bye.